know, the, uh, the swell of hatred and violence that is overtaking our country lately makes my heart literally hurt. The, uh, the thing is, black lives, black lives do matter. But so do law enforcement lives. So do military personnel lives. So do white, yellow, red, and any other color lives. All life matters. And it's stupid of us to try and divide out this the way we have and bring about more violence, more division, more hatred. It makes no sense. The Bible is clear that all of us are worthy of death, but not at each other's hands. The Bible says that we are all guilty. We are all guilty of sin. The punishment of sin is death, eternal death. God is the judge. He is the one who will, who will decide eventually on our fate. We are to trust and to believe. Bible tells us that the only one ever meant to die, born to die, was Jesus Christ, the Son of God. And he did that willingly to save each one of us. He said, they don't take my life from me, I lay my life down. And he did it for us. The Bible tells us that if we will only believe and have faith, we'll have peace in our hearts that that surpasses all understanding. All lives matter. We just have to have faith and believe in what God's Word says and come together and do what Jesus said. Two things. He said, love the Lord your God with all your heart, soul, mind, and strength and love your neighbor as yourself. That's it. We just gotta trust God Give it over to Jesus and love one another. All this hate, all this violence, it's exactly what the enemy wants to tear us apart. And I don't just mean the enemy as in the ones perpetuating this hate and violence or the terrorists. I mean the spiritual enemies. And if you don't believe in the spiritual powers, then you're in you need to you need to do some deep searching because there are spiritual powers of good and of evil there's the light and the dark the bible says there ain't no gray you fall on one side or the other god loved the world so much he sent his own and only son his only begotten son so that none of us should perish so that all of us should have peace happiness and an eventual eternal dwelling in a place of perfection. Choose God, choose peace, choose Jesus. God bless you.